the the whole issue of of uh, the, the the program, I guess, is to uh, in, just reinforce the the issue that that Major League Baseball played a big part. Actually, professional baseball played a big part in uh, the, the war effort in World War II, and obviously in Korea as as well. And uh, Jerry, as someone who who served in in both wars, we should point out, of course, that Ted Williams served in both wars. But in World War II, Ted was a flight instructor and did not see combat, but saw combat in Korea. But um, when when the call came for the Korean War, was there any uh, you know any reluctance on your part to go back? No, I was dumb enough to think I'd give up these two years and be right back where I was. I never came back to what I was, which doesn't bother me in the least, I'll be very honest with you. But basically, I was always proud to be a Marine Naval Aviator, and uh, frankly, uh, it never entered my mind to think that I wasn't going to be as good as I was before. I found out later that I wasn't as good as I was before. But uh, th those are the kinds of things. I mean, you, you, you play baseball against your country. It's not a contest. Your country comes first, period. John, you actually put up good numbers with uh, Chicago when you, when you came out of the war. True. Um, in terms of the opportunities presented to you, obviously, baseball, Major League Baseball, was just integrating at that point in time. Did a door just not open for you? Not really. Uh, I'm trying to think back during that time when Jackie went in. It, it was it was hard, and everybody was asking whether you think Jackie would make it. I said, sure, I think he's going to make it, because Jackie could he could take the pressure, he could withstand the pressure, and he could he could do a lot of things. And uh, I think if I had the uh, same opportunity to do, I'd do the same thing that Jackie did. I I would get angry, but I would turn up the cheek and go ahead on, and then not try to. Uh, intimidate anybody or cause trouble because that was a no-no. But Brad Ricky hired him, he said, Jackie, you, you have to do and say no a lot of things, and he did. And I would do the same thing. Yeah, I haven't had anybody to how to fight what, what went on. That was life. I understood, like I said, I understood where life was going, and I accepted it. And today, it, it has changed a lot, but I'm not complaining. I'm just explaining. Yeah. <laughs>